Hi, ma'am. Good morning. Good morning, ma'am. Yes, can I have a your resume, please? Yes, ma'am. Sai Krishna. Yes, ma'am. Please quickly introduce yourself. Myself, Sai Krishna. Uh, I am uh, from Vijayawada, currently staying in Hyderabad. I did my graduation at Sri Vasmi Institute of Engineering and Technology in the stream of Metamaker in the year 2021. And I got a percentage of 60 percentage. I and mean, in the diploma is the uh, same college, I got a 70 percent. And into coming to my project, uh, I am a project in GES, that means Kinetic Energy Recovering System. We can take a one bicycle example and we will use some energy and we will suddenly apply the brake and we will use this some energy and that time we will store a one place in the, in the uh, that energy we can again uh, take that energy and we will move the fast in the cycle now. Okay. You completed mechanical mechanical engineering. So why do you want to shift from non IT to IT? Uh, um, ma'am, that means uh, nowadays IT field uh, day by day increasing and more future opportunities. Mm -hmm. So in the compared to mechanical side, mm -hmm. uh, in future also uh, IT professionals and uh, IT is increasing more. I think uh, I'm bright future in in this uh, IT. So that's why I'm choosing in IT technology. So you have completed any courses? Yes, ma'am. I have a good knowledge of. Uh, Java and the manual testing and automation testing. Yes, now mentioned in your resume. Yes, yes ma'am. So, you are good in testing? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Let me ask uh, questions in that. Okay. Uh, can you say the difference between the verification and validation? Yes, ma'am. Uh, verification means uh, we can do a test process of before they develop the application. Mm -hmm. And validation me after they develop the application, uh, we can uh, validate the application uh, properly working or not, and properly develop or not. Okay. What is prototype model? In this uh, prototype model, uh, in the lack of requirement or customer confusing requirement, mm -hmm. uh, we can uh, create a one dummy application that will be sent to the client and we will accept that application, the dummy application. We are the BA business analyst, uh, uh, he was uh, created a, a one STLC for process and like uh, uh, analysis, coding and designing uh, based on the dummy application. Mm -hmm. And next we can uh, proceed to, uh, based on that dummy application, we can proceed to the uh, actual application. So what is the advantage in that? Uh, in that we have a easily, easily uh, customer needs, what customer needs, we can easily fulfill that needs. Mm -hmm. And it is uh, fruitful for small projects mm -hmm. and quickly uh, deliver it to the customer. Okay. So any changes is required, we can, we can. change it easily. Easy. Because we are the developing a yeah, dummy application, dummy right? application. and delivering to the client, right? So, yes. So, what is Agile methodology? Uh, Agile methodology means uh, it is iterative and increment model. Mm -hmm. Iterative means uh, you can do a same process again and again. Mm -hmm. uh, with multiple times you can do a process like uh, designing and analysis, coding and testing. You can do it again and again. An incremental model in any new feature added, we can easily add it in Agile process. Mm -hmm. In the uh, Agile, um, follow the some principles. That means uh, uh, client no need to wait for a long time, and uh, also we will uh, um, we will easily and uh, um, quickly uh, deliver it to the product to the client, and also. That's a yes, piece of software. Yes. Okay, Java one. So Scrum. So what is Scrum? Scrum is a uh, framework, uh, like a, yeah, one of the principle of the Agile process. Mm -hmm. uh, the Scrum master will take the uh, Agile principles, mm -hmm. and uh, like he will do a day by day meetings and Scrum meetings, and all the uh, what we do work 
and what next we will do the work uh, now when we can polish any issues on that one scrum master will do the will follow the all agile principles okay. he is going to derive uh, or drive all the agile all the agile principles principles yes so what is uh, sprint retrospective meeting sprint retrospective meeting means uh, it uh, what we will do the today and what we will do tomorrow and uh, what any issues in current applications uh, it will be discussed in that process now uh, i am asking yeah. about sprint retrospective meeting so you are saying uh, sprint planning meeting mm -hmm. sprint is retrospective meeting. at last they will conduct right yes yes once the uh, everything audit process everything completed the testing and testing. Developing yeah, testing, you. everything completed and hand over to the client. Fine. At last, implement type like perspective meeting, they will be involving, right? So, what they are going to do with that? And they are doing uh, uh, to, con uh, to conduct a scrum meeting. So, what went well? What went wrong? Yes. Confused. So, what are all the test levels? Testing levels means uh, four levels of testing: unit testing, integration testing, and system testing, mm -hmm. and user acceptance testing, ma'am. Okay. What is UAD testing? Uh, user acceptance testing means uh, uh, here what happens: uh, client itself uh, uh, testing the application, what requirements there, mm -hmm. and uh, require what application developed properly or not mm -hmm. directly. Client will test that application, mm -hmm. and uh, there is a two levels of uh, in that application. What is alpha testing and beta testing? Mm -hmm. Alpha testing means uh, 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 alpha testing do a uh, client or customer. Mm -hmm. They can do that in the development and the tester environment. Yeah. It means uh, uh, the client or customer directly come to the company, mm -hmm. and they will test the uh, developing and the testing. Mm -hmm. They do the same things. Okay. And the uh, beta testing is a like uh, uh, user environment. That, that means uh, after end to end uh, testing is beta testing. Mm -hmm. uh, what is STLC? STLC uh, stands for uh, Software Testing Life Cycle. Mm -hmm. It's uh, implemented for the testing process. Okay. Uh, so in STLC, we have uh, some process mm -hmm. uh, that means uh, testing planning, testing analysis, and uh, test distribution, mm -hmm. testing environment, and also um, a bug report mm -hmm. and the sign up. Uh, test analysis means uh, we can uh, uh, requirement uh, gatherings. Mm -hmm. And we will uh, take the all the requirements, analysis the all the requirements, and the test planning means um, we can plan the uh, test scenarios and test cases, mm -hmm. how to test what test we can plan the, and test environment means uh, it's a combination of software and hardware. Mm -hmm. It's uh, test planning means, and also mm -hmm. bug report. Uh, after we find a bug, any bug, mm -hmm. we will report it to the developer. So, how will you report a bug to the developer? Uh, if you find any bug, tester find a bug, uh, he will send to the uh, developer manager, mm -hmm. and he will and he, um, he will uh, uh, validate the that bug, um, that defect. After the work validate, mm -hmm. if that validate valid, mm -hmm. he was sending to the, uh, the developer. If not valid, uh, he was uh, asking for the tester uh, need more information to that. Uh, In different tracking tracking track, um, tool. tool. Different tracking tool. Yes. He can do if it is valid, then it will be open, open and it will be processed yes. later. If it is not valid, yes. means it will be rejected. What is, uh, can you give some test scenario for PEN? Okay, madam. Uh, PEN means, uh, first of all, uh, we can test a type of PEN, uh, like uh, 
uh, ball pen or ink pen or gel pen. Mm -hmm. And next we can uh, verify the uh, testing the uh, ink, what type of ink we can use. And next we will test the uh, cap or without cap. Mm -hmm. And next we will test the smoothness of pen. Mm -hmm. Next we will test the and, uh, comfort of pen. We will and we like the anything uh, mm -hmm. that is comfort or not. Next we will write the uh, testing the uh, that means uh, logo and color. Mm -hmm. And next we will testing the design of the pen. And this that some test and also for the pen. Yes, good. Uh, what is severity and priority? Uh, Severity means uh, yeah, seriousness of uh, defect, ma'am. Mm -hmm. uh, that means uh, if there any uh, business uh, business impact on the mm -hmm. defect. Okay. If, we, if we find a defect, mm -hmm. uh, if that defect uh, will affect the any business impact our business. Our applications. Our applications yeah. or business. Mm -hmm. uh, that means severity. Uh, it follows the four principles like uh, block mm -hmm. uh, and uh, critical mm -hmm. and major and minor. Uh, block means uh, total server will shut down, the mm -hmm. app will not open um, and the server will crash it. Mm -hmm. That will uh, we can severely take the, uh, on the blockchain. Um, and the major and minor also we can take the uh, major uh, principles we can take the any login issues. Mm -hmm. uh, any uh, not login working issues we can mm -hmm. take that and minor issues you can any spelling mistakes or color mistakes we mm -hmm. can take that. And priority? Priority means um, uh, impact of the defect ma'am actually priority means mm -hmm. uh, it's uh, divided into three parts uh, P0 and that means mm -hmm. high level, medium and low level priority. Okay. High level priority means uh, it's an uh, we can uh, log in or in any effect in the login page mm -hmm. and that high level priority. In low level priority means any uh, spelling mistakes or same, okay. same as well, ma'am. Okay. Uh, what is the difference between RTM? RTM means uh, requirement. Uh, requirement Requirement traceability matrix. Requirement traceability matrix. We can use this uh, for a uh, uh, test description and uh, mm. we can uh, uh, tracking the bug report actually. Yes. But uh, we can uh, create a one table for uh, tracking bug report. Mm. Uh, that is a uh, test description mm. and the uh, test ID and uh, we can lastly give the uh, what the test pass or fail we can give. Yes. Confidence and more confidence? Confidence means uh, if uh, our team leader uh, he can give any task, mm -hmm. uh, I can set to him, I can do that uh, particular task. Mm -hmm. uh, that is confidence. Mm -hmm. Our confidence means he can give uh, any uh, in my technical skills outside, uh, he will give any work. Mm -hmm. That time, uh, I can, that time also I can do that work. Uh, if I can do that work, uh, if any chances to fail the work, he can give me. If that is like our confidence. Okay. How will you handle the work pressure? Actually, ma'am, uh, I have a more patience. Okay. Um, that's I will uh, divide into if I have a heavy work pressure, uh, I will adjust my timetable and I will divide it my work and uh, I will. I will manage the time on the do that. Where do you want to see yourself after five years? Um, like after five years, uh, I can see uh, as a uh, senior developer, mm -hmm. like uh, any game design, like that. My own. Oh. In my own, I want to design a yeah, new developing gaming system. Okay. I want to improve my skills in after five years. 